What is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here, and we are playing some RimWorld. This is the Ice Sheet playthrough, and it is negative 223 out. Still early winter. People sharing a chair. They're both getting that benefit from the comfort, so that's okay. Getting some... We're growing heel root. Cotton. We need more rice. Things seem to be holding so far, and we have... Rice just came out of the sky, so we're doing all right. If everybody restricted to inside, because it's negative 232 out now, still early winter, son of a bitch. We need to get over that. And there was an eclipse on, but that's ending now, so we needed to figure out what to do with this. Ah, uh, uh, look at this shit. Good thing we bought components. We just bought as many components as we could. I'm trying to get the drug trade up and running full steam, but... As always, we're short on steel. So, in terms of reclamation, we could reclaim these blocks, this block, and even all these if we just close this up. So, I'm pretty sure it's not ideal. I don't like that they have to walk all the way around. But if we close this up, it's going to do us a big favor. So, I'm just going to bite the bullet. Uh, I want slate. This is slate. So, let's do that. And we'll deconstruct that. Deconstruct that. There you go. And then we could do some deconstruction in here. We're going to get a few heaters set up in here. Power seems to be a slight bit sketchy at the minute. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. It doesn't really make sense to get those bedrooms prepped when we don't need them at this very minute. So let's see what two heaters in here does for us other than eat up a bunch of our components and steel. Still working on getting everything nicely heated. It's really cold in here. Yeah. This may need a double wall. There just may be no getting around that. Holy shit. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Inspired taming. You gotta be kidding me. That's the second time we've had that. So did we lose a component? I think we did. You gotta be shitting me on that. Soon we'll have some more drugs. One heater. Got this room decent. Alright, good. We're getting cloth, so they'll get back on making these floors. I pushed this wall back after the fact. This room is slightly impressive. Alright, so in here, where are we hovering? And this is the dead of winter, so as long as we can keep things around 40 in the dead of winter, we're okay. So power is not spinning at all. And we are losing it quick, man. And this bad boy's not even running. Turn this off quickly. Ooh, that's rough. That's very rough. If only there were geothermal here. We might just have to bite the bullet and build more batteries. Maybe another generator. Another transport pod. Spiffy. Camel hide sucks. We get until neg 10. It's negative 235. We might not even be able to get out there and get this guy at this point. <laughs> we want that slag. No. Chemical interest sucks. And we are making drugs. Plus he's got a scar. All right. Who can stand up to the coldest temps? 111, 133, 120. All right. So you... Unrestricted strip. Everybody's probably needing to get outside anyway. If he dies before she gets there, that's going to suck. Where's she at? Eh, she's getting there. Alright, so then we'll just do this little trick because she doesn't haul. And she's at minor 20. She should be fine. Holy shit. <laughs> okay, I mean, hopefully... If she goes down, we have people that can rescue her. And we got frostbite. Let's come inside. Drop all your gear. Undraft. I don't want you going in here because it is negative. Son of a bitch. You know what? No meds. There you go. That isn't going too fast. 
New Lovers, what was that? Yes! Frederick and Reagan have hooked up, dude. That's glorious. All right, we're getting some more of these floors put in. All right, 45 minutes later, she's done tending herself. Not very well. Let's check our situation. You're good. Yeah, okay. Well, what's Frederick's story? Oh, he's a 21-year-old dude. That's perfect because she's 20. I, where, I didn't even consider that when I picked those pawns up, or that guy up. So that works out really well. Let's go ahead and reconnect this so we can nab that steel. So I think we're going to need another one of these. You'd like it to be if it's here, we're like halfway, we're still doing okay. Man, that shit tanks out fast. I don't have infinite components, so that's why I'm hesitating. We do have an open bedroom now. I only want like six to eight pawns, so we might not even need all this at this point. Oh, look, nobody can even get in here to do this deconstruction. <laughs> all right, so let's go ahead and deconstruct this. Hold on, what's our temp over here? Six. We need to get it around 40 this time of the year. So there's that. We also might need more food. No one's doing any cleaning. It looks like the rice pile is growing. Yeah, we have 36 meals. They have more coming in every second. Well, I guess we'll see what happens. All right, we can probably allow this again. And let's go check Lux with her inspired taming. Yeah, she totally healed up. Good. We did the right thing. Although it didn't feel like it at the time. Ah, oh, look at that. We're making drugs. fan frickin tastic Get those delivered. We really need mega sloth wool. Guinea pig fur. One of those two. This can be turned back off. All right, so look at the way they're kicking now. We're doing just fine. How's this room now? Okay, perfect. So now we can do our deconstruction down here. This one we don't need. This one we don't need. That one I shouldn't have built. This. All right, let's get rid of all those. So that's going to nab us some more material. I'm still not enthused with how this ended up, but I could build another section here and reclaim this space, but for now I think it's fine. I think we might have too many bedrooms now, though. So we could use this space for something, perhaps. All right, so here we ended up at 54. So let's deconstruct this. And then that'll be a door. I could probably put a stone door in, which would... Don't deconstruct. Which would encourage them. No, I guess it doesn't matter. And these rooms were not heating yet, so they're extremely cold. So I think we'll keep this wall until we need these rooms. It does give us the option of having more pawns. Power's doing great. I think we'll be okay with just these three more. Because there's not a lot more that we're going to need here. Maybe we won't even need those three, which is good. So perhaps another battery is in order, but probably take a lot of components. They take two. 70 steel is a tall order, man. And I was going to move this out once we got another pawn, make another chair, but we're using the cloth on the floors. We don't have a floor under that door yet, so let's go ahead and do that. We're doing concrete. This zone can be expanded to fill that little spot. Man, I don't like wasting steel on doors, really. And let's deconstruct these as well. There might be one under that, dude. Oh, shit. Reconnect quickly. Especially you two. Bloody hell. There we go. Okay. 
So this room's cold as shit, but it's coming from over here. So once we get this door in, we should be okay. And we want a double wall there. These double walls will help too, because it'll block it off from the outside. Yeah, that helped right away. So as long as this goes up to 40, it's not. But once we heat this, it will. All right, we're set for now, <laughs> I think. As long as this room stays warm and this room stays warm. So these rooms, because this room's cold. Ah, yeah, look at that. We're in the 50s. We're perfect. All right, with all that stuff going, I think our next priority is still damn cold in here. But again, once these are heated, we just rip this wall down. Good to go. Anyways, our next priority, I think, needs to be getting grow beds up so we can get the drug trade going. Everybody's bored. I suspect everybody needs to go outside, too. Let's see if we can't handle that problem. And again, I don't like this area, but it is what it is. Uh, looks like nobody put that thing back out here. That's a potential risk. And needs. Everybody's happy anyway, so it doesn't really matter. All right, you're good. What about you guys? Underground or outdoors? Well, you don't need to come out. <laughs> stuck indoors and stuck indoors. There you go. Everybody back in. And so where do we end up? 175 steel. Power's doing great, so let's go ahead and get that other grow bed going. Components we have to watch as well. This will be the last one we build because we're going to be short on components. Fabrication bench is definitely going to be needed here. I can probably reinstall this over here. Put the fab bench down here. This needs to go as well. This is unnecessary. What's this? Bison. This is a backup. <laughs> we do have tattered apparel on Bart, but there's not... Oh, turn that thing back off. All right, so at just under half mass, the power's growing good. So I was tempted to make another one, but I don't think that's necessary right now. We're getting more hill rut. Shit, we have a broken down heater. Okay, that's interesting. It's not staying 70 in there. These rooms aren't staying 70, but it is neg 209. We're in midwinter, so it's going to start getting warmer now. What are you doing? Oh, that's your bedroom now. Never mind. <laughs> Cheers to the patrons, Alexander, Viking, Brandon, Cobra, Samurai, Corno B, Dapper Go, Dirtle Dave, Thauburn, Frederick, Henry Wallace, Howard, Shan, Josh, Grace, Michael, Rakestraw, Wake Mata, President Luck, Seamus, Shiggy, Tyrant X, Typhios, Adam Bartnikowski, and Axum Yellow. You guys are awesome, awesome people. I very much appreciate it. We can build a fab bench. We're going to need it for advanced components. We don't have the material. We need components and steel. And rice ended up going into that one. How are we doing for rice? 568. Let's, uh, let's get on the drug train here. So getting these all fleshed out, next big priority. Some light in here wouldn't be a bad idea either. Temps are solid. We could flesh out the hospital. What to make the beds out of? It's going to have to be stone. What are these beds made out of? Marble, marble, steel. But it's excellent. I'm tempted to reclaim that steel and move a stone bed over there. Mostly because we're so short on steel. <laughs> Look at the wind go. Holy shit. Yeah, I'd say we're charging pretty rapidly. I'd like two more batteries sooner rather than later as well, but 
just to give them something to do. I think some beds are in order. And in terms of what we need to build, we need to build security as well. So let's go take a peek at that. What do these take? Five each. So this is going to be like the first step in security here. <laughs> Just something to hide behind when we get raided. No one's doing any repairs. I'm going to unrestrict everybody so they do repairs. That'll get them outside doing something. But I keep saying we're going to do security and then not doing it. Oh, these take cloth now. That's interesting. Waist high, cover, ugly, better cover than other low objects. Better cover than other low objects. Interesting that we could do either or. We don't have a ton of anything right now. Sadly. All right, well, let's just do slate. We need something. We don't want people hiding here, but there's not a lot we can do about that. Other than put our barricade out here. That'll probably get deconstructed at some point. We only have four pawns, so it probably doesn't need to be that big. There we go. That should be a little more sensible. All right, they're not staying outside very long, so that's good. It's weird having all these people, man. So, 5 times 9 is 45. So we should be able to do something similar on the other end as well. Somebody moved this finally, which is good. I want to make sure that they can't hide behind this, so this needs to be down further. This one might need to be a complete circle. We'll see if we get all that done. And that billiards table paying dividends. If you guys are enjoying this, please, please give me a like. I very much appreciate it. It does help me out. That's the first time I've built a barricade, by the way. Getting some food. Short on steel, short on components. So now we're back in that waiting game. I'm going to check the dev log just to make sure nothing's gone south on me. No, we're doing well. Events should be happening normally here. That's an interesting pattern they've built it into. How are we doing for rice? All right, we have enough for 23 more meals. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six. I think we're going to come up a little short. But one of our next priorities is building more of those. I'm going to try and keep two bins per pawn with food. All right, well, we have some security up there. It's mediocre as it is. <laughs> At least it gives us something to hide in. Hopefully they don't get behind us. You know what? If they do, they'll be over here. So we'll do that. Maybe we don't need this. I'm going to leave it. If they come over here and they're shooting at us. If that saves one person getting shot one time, it might have saved their lives. So it's totally worth it. All right. Well, let's see. It's negative 238 outside. Let's check temps. Ooh, man. Doesn't look good. <laughs> All blue. <laughs> This room's not staying warm, but it, it's the dead of winter, so this room isn't either. Everything will be warmer once we get this stuff warmed up, though, so I think we're okay. Someone's hypothermic, naturally. Jesus, get inside. Don't get frostbite, please. All right, she stopped, so it must be safer there. There, that one's done. It appears as if all the repairs were done as well, so that's good. So once that this is done, I'll just restrict everybody back to inside. Regan, health, 
still shivering, but not for long. You can be unrestricted then. Do we end up with enough blocks? Yeah, we have nine stacked yet. So the next big thing to do is plan out the kill box. I think it makes sense to run this straight out. Maybe connect here. It depends what the range of the guns are. Man, these drugs grow so freaking slow. Do we end up with any dope? Oh yeah, we have 15 right now. So that's effectively free money. You gotta go back inside, my dear. You are okay for the minute. Okay. Alright, good. He's like, you know what? This sucks. I'm going in. Alright, well we are getting some cloth so we can do some more flooring. This room is already impressive. This room, can I see it? It's awful. So I'll probably put something in here since they're walking through. Uh, that's not good. We have two. F Look at the happiness here. So since everybody's coupled up, it's just been awesome. I'm going to keep this heater running. Arguably, no one's in there. It's not necessary, but that's okay. All right, you're in bed, so by morning, you should be free range again. All right, dude just joined. <laughs> dude. A fast learner that's nimble, but doesn't do shit, man. This guy could be our cleaner. Is he going to provide anything else meaningful? He can mine a little bit. We don't have gear for him. He showed up with meals and a knife. It's only good till 14. He's not likely to make it over here. And he's already got issues. These skills are really good. Interesting. I don't know. I'm not impressed. Ah, he's a 43-year-old male. He's not going to make it. That's for sure. It's negative 230 out. We need to get his gear. I'm going to just not have him. I need pawns that can contribute in many different ways. He is not such a pawn. There you go. So you go strip him. We'll get this and this hauled. We will unrestrict Regan, which she is. And you just go ahead and haul all that stuff in. So we can probably smelt this knife up. Dude, did not last long. Somebody get him buried. It's going to cause a little crabbiness. He's got a sweet haircut. Mm, looks like a little bit of bed head or something, actually. Well, he brought us a few meals. We're not butchering humans. If we are butchering humans, we'd be rich because we'd have so much human leather. Interesting that you just looked at him and cleaned up around him and didn't do shit else. <laughs> Alright, do we ever get that done? Damn near. Alright, he's in the ground. It might be time to build some more graves too. We'll finish this and then we'll restrict everybody to the inside for a while. She might not make it that long. She's good till negative 111. All right, good. So you're golden. Those graves are not important. Let's get everybody in. Temps. Tottering right below freezing here. There you go. So we have deep drilling and scanners. So I'm just going to start at the top over here. We need an AI persona core. Three colonicidal. <laughs> uh, there was one thing we could smelt, I think. Where'd that dude's knife go? So let's reconnect. Update that bill. Bam. Tempted to still smelt these shotguns. If anybody gets in the base, those shotguns are going to be awesome. How's the batteries doing? They're not doing the best. Get that turned off. Yeah, they are definitely not doing the best. So you go through these waves where you have tons of power. Works great for a long while. And then you go through these times when it's like this. We may have to turn our light off. Well, it looks like it's coming around. Yeah. Oh, 
Damn it. Why is it an exotic goods trader? That sucks. All right, let's get this moved. I really want a bulk goods trader. And let's unrestrict everybody and see if somebody goes and moves that for me sooner rather than later. Nope. He's going to go build graves. I want you to move this. Hey, there's a party on. Very nice. Happiness is just easy once they couple up. Now when they break up, that's going to be problematic, but... All right, needs. You're so happy, I don't even care. I want to see... I don't want that trader to leave. Usually they hang out for a little bit. Come on, you guys can end this party any second. Slept in the cold, colonists died, hungry. All right, there you go, attended party, bam. Come call these dudes up. Beautiful, we have tea, worth six bucks each. We need components. I'm gonna spend all the money we have, which isn't much. <laughs> We buy two components for 43 bucks. Do you have steel? We can just make our own. You have no steel. No healer mech serum. Not that it matters. We don't have any money. No guinea pigs. All right. Somebody get those hauled in. Mm. The psychic drone is ending. <clears throat> Indeed. Well, we got two components, whatever that's worth. Not much. I do have more drugs. If we could get that cooked up, we could call them back. So Frederick's working on that for us. I don't have any night owls, do we? I don't think we do. Works out that they all go to bed together anyways, because that's when you get happy time coming in. Luck still has inspired taming. God, we need good material. We need a bulk goods trader so bad. All right, yeah, there's that happy time I was talking about. He's going to continue to make drugs. So hopefully they don't bail before he's done with that, but I suspect they will. They don't generally hang out forever. You're going to go make some graves, which is probably a good thing. All right, we got two more lots of drugs we can make. Oh, they left. Oh, well, it's fine. Nobody's interested in this wooden mace. I might go dump it in the ice, on the ice, whatever. It's been here for a long time. None of the traders have been interested in it. We can't smelt it. Does it say whether it's smeltable? I think because of what it's made of. Wood, it's not. Speaking of wood, we only have 70 now. We use some of it on something. All right, Frederick, pick this up. All right, now we're going to drop that. Boom, we're going to forbid it. And that'll drop our wealth a bit. Let's check our history, speaking of wealth. Yikes. You can see when Bart left the map. <laughs> this, I don't, yeah, whatever. Interesting. So it looks like building wealth is way up. Item wealth we're keeping relatively low because we're always cycling things in and out. But we're building, we're going to do a bunch of carpets yet, so that's going to hurt. And you can see our pawns slowly trend up as they gain skills or as we gain extra pawns. I would have expected this. Where did Frederick join? Must have been here. I don't know. Whatever. There you go. So, next time, what are we going to do? <laughs> Still considering reclaiming the steel on this bed. I was going to make hospital beds. I think we'll finish getting the hospital fleshed out. Uh, we do have a bunch of cloth. Cloth is not sterile, but I think sterile tile is expensive. 12 silver. That's a tall order right now. At some point, it'll be easy, but... I don't know, we might go cloth and then just rip it up later, but either way, thanks for watching. Please leave me a like, it does help me out. Please subscribe as well if you're not and you are enjoying this. We want to reinstall this outside somewhere. 
I don't like that this can get shot up because what's it take to rebuild? Yeah, whatever. It is what it is. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.